I'm actually curious what the next boss is going to be after this guy, though. Because this is like the third boss of the game, and technically I've seen every one of these bosses in trailers. I mean, I can't recall another boss that I've seen, so technically after this one, I think everything will be brand new territory. Like, I know the Cleric Beast, I know how you're supposed to fight the Cleric Beast, I know even how you're supposed to kill the Cleric Beast, and still that's the one I've died the most on so far. The father of Gastion, I mean, I've seen a bit of him, I knew he was a boss fight in that area. I went the wrong way. And then I've seen a video of this fucking boss. Like, gameplay of people fighting him. So I know these are all bosses. Like, you know what I mean? And I've, I, I, there's no, like, wow factor because I know what they look like and everything. So I'm curious what the next boss is actually going to be. Oh, fuck you. There's no way. I was, like, walking so slow. He's got blue eyes. He actually hit me. Wow. Oh, what's this do? Poisons the shit out of me. It's just an instant poison. Okay. Where's this dog? Where the fuck did it come from? There he is. Alright, we're not gonna fuck with him. Dun 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 dun. Oh, there's a message in here, really. Fire is effective. Oh, thank you, thank you. Now let's try fire paper. He does that. Where is he? Oh, that damage. I'm trying to actually use the dodges a bit more. Oh, he evolved. He's like second stage now. Oh yeah, he's a lot faster and he like almost instant poisoned me. There goes my fire buff. Fuck. Yeah, I got slow poison. I probably should have equipped those antidotes. Oh my god, I'm gonna die here? Where's the antidote? Fuck, I actually don't have it on my quick slots. Okay, I'm dead. <laughs> I thought I could maybe get it in time. I was like trying to do it really fast. Ah, uh, fuck off. Oh fuck. I was not expecting that. I mean, he did it, the wind up and everything, but I just, and I just still got him. Duh. This guy's Kirk Hammer in the fuck out. I haven't even tried the Kirk Hammer yet. Maybe that'd be really good against him. With the heavy damage. Now he's in rage mode, so this will be interesting. Every one of them like has a frenzy attack where they hit you like four fucking times in a row when they go into rage. Oh my god, please, no. I just got rid of your poison. Fuck. There we go, and let me get back out here. Oh shit, he turned around! Here, cure it. Fast. Fuck. How many open? I can actually dodge your shit. Oh, that's not fucking good. I don't want to level 4, dude. He evolved twice. What is he doing? He's like spewing acid everywhere. 
probably get poisoned on one hit now. His attacks are a lot worse. Definitely. I'm gonna get fucked. Yep, he grabbed me. And I'm poisoned. I'm dead. In one shot. Okay, that's cool. I haven't seen that attack before, so I don't know what to do. I mean, technically I still haven't really seen it because I didn't know what the fuck he did. He just leaped at me and grabbed me. So, I didn't, know, I didn't see the build up. You're telling me I don't have any more fucking antidotes? I thought I had like seven of these in my storage. Well, I gotta make sure I beat this guy soon. Huh. Oh my god, can you like do a different- I Seriously, I'm tired of chasing you around this room, bro. He's under like every fucking time I get close to him, he just does this attack. Fuck, man. I can't get any hits on him. He, like, moves too much after every attack. Oh my god, he's, like, scared of me. I didn't hit... Oh, this is getting annoying as fuck right now. He's gonna evolve. Hit him in the face. Oh, I'm gonna die. Yeah, I'm dead. Pretty much. Pop this. You really don't want to make any mistakes. Oh, I'm dead again. Fuck! It's really annoying because he just like stands there for a split second and he just leaps at you. So it's like, you have to notice that he's just standing there and not moving because it's like, I don't know what the fuck the AI is doing. He doesn't like have to make any like big fuck quick movements to like show you that he just like literally halts in place and then leaps. I realized something was up, but I I just couldn't dodge in time. I got fucked. I right, should I try the Kirk hammer. Let's check it out. Oh, this is actually like a legit sword too. The same other kind of thrusting attack with the heavy. This is why I do a fuck ton of damage on him. <laughs> okay. I'll try the Kirk Hammer on him, because I kind of feel like I got his early game down at the very least. I feel like his mid game I got as well, but I just can't afford to get hit or else you get fucked pretty much anyways. At all. Like, because the poison screws you. I'll cover my measly souls. Alright, come fight me. I'll be in the middle of the room, bro, if you ever actually want to take this seriously. Still over here. Dude, I'm not a fucking bull tamer. I can't keep this up forever. Like, seriously, I'm tired of, like, just outsmarting you. This boss fight right here. This is so intense, are very hard and deadly. I definitely have no chance. Kinda stun locks him, which is actually kinda nice. I did 64? Really? Wow. I was about to charge it up, but I thought he might hit me there, so I kinda panicked. Only did 75? Ooh, fuck the Kirk Hammer. Ugh! Sorry, no. This spear is by far better. Way faster than attacks. Could I have attacked him right there? Just antidote this up. Fuck! 
fuck, man? Give me help. This is relentless, son of a bitch. I can't even see my screen. I'm just dodging non-stop. Holy shit. What is life? He's gonna expel poison again, isn't he? That's probably your opening to attack him, and I'm just stupid for not taking it. Oh no! Shit, go, 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 go! Fuck! I used no stop attacks like a fuck man! He had no health left, I would've killed him! Oh. Oh. oh my god, man. I don't know if that hurts you when he like does that roar if you're right next to him because like every other Dark Souls game, like basically that shit happens. So I'm trying to avoid it, but he does it multiple times. So I'm assuming that's how he keeps the poison going. So I, I assume it would be an opening. I'm actually running out of fucking vials now because of this stupid shit. I had to just burn, th I burned through like seven vials on that fucking poison, probably. At least five, I'd say. There's nothing you can do about it. It's like the game either wants you to co-op there so you can have somebody else like fight him and distract him so you can hit him and like heal him easily. Or like, you just gotta fucking farm a bunch of vials for this shit. Cause that's some ridiculous poison damage. Where did I get poisoned from? What the fuck? He was two hits away from dying, basically, at the end there. So I was making the mistake of dodging f backwards. You always want to dodge towards this thing, since he just attacks non-stop. So technically, I believe that way, like, he'll, he'll just attack past you, and you can have more time to do whatever the fuck it is you wanted to do. I think dodge is way too much though, it's really annoying. And then he like lunges out of your fucking lock on range, which doesn't help in fact. This is like most used attack on stage one, I swear to god. Cocky hit I just got right there. So easy to avoid that if you're close to him. Oh no, you missed. that up. No. Not this time, bitch. I almost fucked that up too. Hey, asshole. Thought he was gonna do it again, not gonna lie. Looked like he was going to. Oh my god, he hit me through a wall? Fuck you! He's gonna level up now. He'll probably get full health as soon as possible. Is he gonna expel poison right now? That does knock you back. Okay, now I know. Fuck you. Okay, 
conseguido. Bien. Not necessarily want to jump there. See if he's gonna poison out again. Heal right now. No. Oh god. Kill it. Kill it. Kill it. Oh, fuck you. Holy shit. The Thumeru, blah, 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 Thumeru Chalice. Holy fuck. That poison, man. There go all my fucking stockpiled vials, dude. Need to start like, rebuilding that whole thing up again. Shit. Whew. You know, like, this game came out, like, yesterday. Or, no, did it come out Monday? I think it came out Monday, technically. This game came out whenever. This game came out, like, just, like, a couple days ago, and it's just, like... I'm surprised there's not, like, what? There's, like, three blood stains in here. Like, what the fuck? Like, like, what? Are the PS4 people not into blood more? <laughs> like, uh, or, I don't know. I'm just, like, I'm surprised by the lack of messages. Or, like, lack of, lack of specters as a whole. Like, don't really, you, I swear, you'd see, wouldn't you see, like, a fuck ton more? I swear, like, release for Dark Souls 2, I saw a shit ton of these things everywhere. So don't tell me I actually, I actually have to go and do a Chalice Dungeon right now, don't I? Because there's nowhere else for me to go except for that Vortex. Unless I'm forgetting or missing something else. This looks like the guy from the Odon Chapel. Kind of. What up? Turn to a Hunter's Dream? Hmm. Alright. Well, technically I could fight that Gatling gun guy, and I haven't really explored that roof where that other dude was standing. He hasn't respawned, though. That was actually the first enemy in this game I've encountered that did not respawn upon death. Is that, like, dude who had the trick cleaver? Or whatever? I could buy ritual blood? Really? I'll buy uh, probably two of these. Just for, I don't know, having, stockpiling them. I'll buy, should I buy a bunch of blood vials back? I'll buy six blood vials. Look at that, I'm only holding 15. It's pretty awful. And then I'll buy some Molotov cocktails. And I'll buy two more blood vials for my remaining money. There we go. Fuck leveling up, bro. I got no reason to level up other than like increase my damage slightly. Use the ritual altar to create a chalice dungeon with a chalice ritual, or to search for chalice dungeons created by hunters in other worlds. Ritual Altar. Chalice Ritual. Chalice Dungeon Search. Search by Chalice Glyph. Interesting. A short Ritual Root Chalice is required to conduct a ritual. Oh, so I can't do anything at this one. Let's do the Theramu Chalice. Conduct Ritual. I need the Blood Echoes. Fuck you. Seriously? I just like wasted them all. I only have the one. This this better give me a thousand. Thank the Lord. This is second actually, so we're just gonna go to the first, do it in order. Okay, I wanted to check and see if it would go down. It says that I have it says ritual blood one, but then it says two and then four in brackets. So it's gonna take me two when I have four? Is that what's happening right now? Conduct ritual. Conduct ritual. Create a chalice dungeon. Materials will be consumed. Yes. The ritual's finished, and a chalice rests upon the altar. You may now explore the dungeon. Chamber of the Seal. Depth one. Area Pithermuer. Pithermuer. Pith. There we go. Pithumeru. Fuck! I couldn't pronounce that for the life of me. Chalice glyph. G Z X. G Z G Z Z I X I V M V E. Okay. Move chalice. Expunge dungeon. Erase progress. Mm, chamber of the seal. Let's go. 
So I'm assuming you find different chalices, maybe, because it said like that's the one chalice I had, and it shows on the side there. So it's like maybe don't, they give you different themes, different possibilities for your dungeons. Oh, intriguing. Bethumarian Labyrinth, Layer One. This is gonna be pretty cool, though. Because I mean, like, like the the, the additional chalices will be pretty cool. Because then if people actually like. Who are new to the game or get stuck or like you know what i mean like I, I, it's kind of funny i kind of mean to say like kind of like laugh at this but you won't be able to look up walkthroughs for these because essentially they're supposed to all be different right fill the traps and randomize like rng so people who get stuck won't actually be able to get help on these be pretty interesting i actually specifically avoided watching any of the chalice dungeon videos because I didn't know how in-depth they're going to be since they're supposed to be like a roguelike random randomly generated and such or procedurally generated generated so i don't know any of the traps if there's like arrows that shoot through the walls or there's like a boulder that crushes you uh, i do not know any of those so this will be intriguing it's very close quarters so i'm just expecting to walk into one of these rooms and die 